So in your IIS manager, you're going to create your own site. So it's just going to be add a website, name it whatever, uh, and then <clears throat> select a path for it. Uh, I just made a folder called sites. And then within that folder, I'll name it the exact name of the site. This folder, select that, OK. And then <clears throat> change your port to whatever you want. OK, so I created it. So here it is. Um, I'm going to go ahead and browse this. So I'm going to open up the site. And as you can see here, we have unauthorized. So um, I do not have permissions to this site. So to fix that, we're going to go and see what authorization is already there. So I'll click on authentication, um, anonymous authentication. We're going to go to edit and see what specific user is currently there. So I user. And so that's what I'm going to give permissions in my folder to. So I'll go right here right click give access to specific people type in I user add and then I will give uh, read and write permissions to that user share done okay let's refresh the page and see if this changes there we go so it changed to forbidden and then now if you actually want to see something you can do your own HTML file in here I'm just gonna write one called index.html uh, okay, enter, yes, and then as you can see here, um, the HTML file is now displayed and we did not configure it to anything, so it's going to be blank.